What's up, you guys? So, I'm just chilling. It's the weekend. I'm going to tell you a story about the time, about the time, I met Robin Williams. So, this takes place back when I was 18 years old. It was my brother, me, and my dad, and we, uh, we took like, a guy's trip to Reno, Nevada. We just did a bunch of guy stuff. Like when I remember my dad taking us to... Uh, we did like the RTV's um, adventure where we rode them all around and got all dirty and stuff like that. It was it was fun. It was a really fun trip. Um, and I remember one of the nights we, my dad wanted us, you know, take a nap, lay down, and just relax. And my brother and I, we decided to go to the arcade. And the way Reno set up is that all the I'm not sure if it's still like this. This is like a long time ago. That all the hotels were kind of connected, and in the middle they had this. They had an arcade that we went to, and we were always me, me and my brother. We were always like were into competitions, and we placed a lot of bets. And uh, we had a bet on Street Fighter Two. So we're playing this game, like we're hella into it, right? And I'm going at it. Next thing you know, my brother's like, "Hey, hey!" And he's like, like hitting me a little bit. He's like, I'm "Like what, dude? Stop trying to cheat!" And he's just like, "No, I'm like there's Robin Williams." I'm like, shut up, you're just trying to cheat. I'm just like playing the game, trying to beat him. He's like, no, really, there's Robin Williams. And I'm like, I turn around, and, and there he was. He was there in the arcade playing one of those shooting games where he's like, ah, you know, playing, playing a shooting game, doing his little thing. And I was just like starstruck. It was the first time I've ever been starstruck. And he's just playing the game. He had his little sh chauffeur, butler dude with him. <laughs> chauffeur. Not a chauffeur. I don't know. I'm not sure what you call him. Little guy to make sure he's taken care of. I remember just staring and like it, having like a un like a surreal feeling. Like it wasn't real. After he's playing games, he I, I I go up to him. I look at him. He's looking right at me, and I'm like, Mr. Williams, hi. And he's like, hello. I'm a, my name is Ted Guerrero. I put my hand out. Right, he shook my hand and like I was trying to be all professional and this and that, and then next thing you know, I'm just like, "Can I have an autograph?" And, he, <laughs> and he's like, "Sure, sure." So, so he signs an autograph, and I held that autograph for years, but it's gone now. I don't know what happened to it. It moved so long, so many times, and uh, I remember just people just waiting to play games with them, playing video games. Uh, so I, we go back to the hotel room and I tell my dad. We, we, we tell my dad that you know, we, we just met Robin Williams. And he was just like, oh, really? Yeah, so it was kind of like, it, it made our night. The trip was really like a special trip because like, it was just me and my brother and my dad and and we met Robin Williams. And it was like, it's one of those things I'll probably never forget. It was, it was a good time in life, you know? Back where everything was so simple. <laughs>